Hello, hello everybody and welcome to the next episode of Salaya's Soviet Republic Workers and Resources Democratic Republic. So, in this game we are going to continue expanding our city and I was thinking in what way can we expand it. So, look, we have about <clears throat> 230 unemployed workers, so I'm going to make some more job opportunities for them. And also I was thinking about increasing the number of buses here because too many people are waiting and there is still no bus in sight so maybe one more bus for each of three stations we have i think that would be more optimal so let's do that right away so let's purchase three more buses and let's assign them to the work immediately so they pick up some more workers on the way and get them to work because we still do want more workers here in our steel mill as you see it's it's on demand it, it's like 144 workers uh, and it can accommodate 500 this one is pretty much staffed these places are pretty much staffed but the steel mill is not let's see about the mines are they staffed they're actually staffed pretty well that's really nice that's really awesome one mine we have is pretty staffed and let's keep sending these workers a little bit more to these places so should we send anybody here? We could actually, see how not many people are currently working here, but many more arriving. Also, let's see what about this one. This is pretty much on demand. So yes, definitely we are going to have to send somebody here. And let's do that right away. Let's pause the game. Lots of people are unemployed. Okay, so let's bring some more workers somehow to these places. So you're going to go from here and you're going to unload workers here and this applies only to workers so i think we're good and you don't even have to take the high educated ones or maybe you can whatever you like they have to work somewhere for now so i suppose it's okay so only workers only workers guys that's good you can go and you you can go from here you can of course go here that's it very good and of course transport only workers around there it goes there it goes you can start moving too and the third bus you will have to start moving in this direction over here to this bus station over there so workers only because there's nothing else for other people there they're just going to be stuck on the bus that's why i don't even want to allow them entry to these buses because people who are not workers really have no any business here this is just an industrial place and that's it all right let's see what is happening here how many people are waiting oh yeah they're all loaded that's very nice that's really good there are some students waiting around to go to school so what we are going to do we are going to make university because i want to start research for the mechanic parts here that could that can be made from this steel i think that's a good idea and what is also my but it's also maybe a good idea is to make some kind of factory that will use this coal because as you see we really have a big surplus of coal because it's really coming in very fast so i was thinking about making a brick factory that will also increase employment in the area so let's do that let's build the brick factory let's see where is the brick factory there it is so where can we where can we put that thing it's not really small Maybe somewhere here? No. That's not going to be easy thing to to do. I don't know what maybe actually we could maybe we could put it here or something. That's that's not a bad idea at all. Or even somewhere here, which might be even better idea. How far is how far is everything from bus station? Huh. Okay, so putting it over here 
might actually be the best idea. Let's try to do that somehow. We have to bring coal to it, of course, but we're going to do that on conveyor belts or maybe even trucks, who knows. So putting it here or here like this might be the best idea if we can pull that pull that off. So let's let's destroy these wires. And let's put our brick factory here. Uh, 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 is it doable? Uh, come on. Really? Really, man? Hmm, strange. I really see no reason why it couldn't be put here. Oh, I see. How about now? Still no? Maybe this wire is still making a problem. Let's try again. Oh, okay. Road might be a little bit too problematic as well. Now let's try. Stopping you from being made, dude. <laughs> Stranger things. If I try to make you like this, how about that? It's doable. Okay, even if the trucks transport the bricks, it's not a big deal. Okay, let's recreate the road that we messed up. There it goes. And I hope everybody can walk to it. Well, they will be able anyway. There it goes. Pretty cool. Okay, so we have three of these trucks transporting steel from the steel mill to the um, to the storage room. Two or three trucks, three trucks. But we can really reroute one of them to transport bricks. Let's see if these guys can get to the brick factory at all. Maybe they can't. They should be able to, if you ask me. Brick factory isn't fast to build. Coal plant and a steel mill. Of course, they, they will have to work in a factory too. All right, my phone is ringing. Sorry.
Okay, everybody, I'm sorry that was a little bit of a phone talk with my brother. Mm, we actually plan, plan to play some games together later. Maybe some new games, Resident Evil or something, when it comes out. He called me about something totally not related to the games. And I'm sorry, I, I was playing the game while talking with him, I hope you don't mind. And yes, we need to build a supply chain for the brick factory. There it goes, that's pretty cool. Wait a second, this unloading station, right? Yes, we should be unloading station. So, some trucks should bring a coal. Coal is going to travel a long way. But never mind. So, let's employ one of these trucks to bring bricks from the brick from the brick plant uh, to the storage room just open storage thing not room really and of course we're going to employ few a few of them to bring coal from the coal storage to the brick factory so let's employ this truck here right away how are you doing with that? Okay, they're they're driving this slowly. They're just enough trucks to take everything. Yes, completely full. So this truck actually will have a new thing to do. So you can go back to depot for now. Because I don't want to just edit it on the go. I want him to either start go, going to depot before I give him a new task to do. Uh, ta -ta 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 -ta. Let's buy one more, one more. Yeah, let's buy one more of the same thing. They can they can transport almost 10 tons of the bricks, which is... Oh, this one actually can transport 10 tons. That's pretty cool as well. Okay. This is open hull, right? And here. Well, this is cheaper truck, so let's buy that one. So you're going to transport uh, bricks from this brick station to here. So you're going to load bricks and you're going to unload bricks. And you can start. Of course there are no bricks yet. But they're going there's there are going to be soon a lot of them. So you can delete these things, you're not going to do this anymore. New task for you, bricks from here to here. So you transport this thing, you load these things, you unload them there, and you are good to go. And we are going to need few trucks to bring coal. So let's buy four of them for coal. Coal, 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 coal. This is like a damper truck, right? Let's buy these. These are cheaper one, they can take most of the coal, you see. 12 tons so and they're not going to be around for much longer so I kind of like them I like to have some of them because later I'm going not going to be able to buy any of them so having some of them some of these Tatra trucks having some of them now Tatra is a factory from Czech Republic uh, ex Czechoslovakia that produce trucks cars and I think mostly trucks and cars and uh, they exist even today, they produce some cars for military, I think, for Czech military and so on. So, new stop, you're going to load coal here and bring coal there. So, load coal and unload coal. And you can even start with that right now. But let me just uh, copy your schedule, I don't want to make... You can go. Do you have the same schedule, guys? Let's see. Yes, everybody has the same schedule. That's cool. So, you can go as well. And you can go as well. And you can go as well. And it should be working. What about unemployment here? Is it dropping? It is, actually. It's dropping a little bit. That's really nice. So, kind of, lots of people are finding employment around. Okay. <clears throat> Missing resources, coal, yeah. So you have workers, you have everything. <clears throat> That's good. 
Let's see how is the coal going to start coming. Well, these guys have kind of a long journey to go through. It would be nicer if we could make everything with conveyor belts, but it's not a very easy thing to pull off, honestly. Actually, we can maybe try to pull it off from here. Maybe just from this. How much do they, 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 consume? they consume only 33 tons of coal? We can actually try that. We could have tried that before I started buying this thing. Hmm. Okay, never mind. Maybe I could transport coal from here, actually, somewhere there. Let's see how well that works. Can I fit this station anywhere here on the map? It's not going to be easy thing to do, honestly, if you ask me. Maybe not possible for now. Never mind, let's just leave it with trucks. I mean, why not, after all? Do we have lots of people waiting around? We do. We still have a lots of lots of people waiting around for a bus. And there is a new bus coming to pick some of them up. We also have lots of lots of students waiting around. I'm going to build school a little later. For now I want to focus on exporting power and, and whatnot. So let's see, are we exporting any power? Actually, we're still importing. Let's check on that. We are exporting power. We can export almost anything we produce. I mean, honestly, why not? Any kind of access we have, we can, we can kind of just export. Because we can. Okay, no trucks have brought any coal yet. The voltage isn't very stable here. What about here? Pretty good. What about here? Pretty good as well. Okay, that's nice. Factory has pretty much enough iron around, lying around, that's good. And they're producing steel, 100 tons of steel already. That's pretty cool. Coal isn't fast to arrive, no it's not. First batches of coil are coming in. Can I actually try to build maybe something from here? No, not really. Even if I put this thing there, well, you know what, let's give it a shot, maybe it, it probably won't work, because it can't go over the, this, this storage room, well never mind, let's just leave it like that, that's like, probably the easiest, oh look how many bricks they already made, that's really awesome, that's nice, and trucks are doing pretty much fine, another one is coming in right soon, Anybody? Who are you slow to get that coal? These guys get filled up with bricks, they do. Yes, very well. So they're going to transport lots of bricks around, which is cool. So we can already buy one train that will export all of these things. So let's buy some of the train. So we are going to need a electric locomotive. And let's buy something that's not going to be around for a long time, something that's quick. I usually buy this, uh, these locomotives from Czechoslovakia. I don't know who manufactures them, but they're, they're not very expensive. They're not amongst the most expensive and uh, they are pretty fast, 160 and they can use the railroad at 150 km per hour, so why should I buy anything slower for such a long journey? So let's buy one of these. Let's buy the red one. It's exporting red goods to Red Republic, so let's buy the red one. And we of course need a wagon. We can, uh, we can put here six or seven wagons. So we're going to need some of them for steel and bricks. And as you see, let's see what's the best for steel and bricks. This is 55 tons of bricks, 69 tons of steel, 67, 53. So these are better, slightly better. Let's buy these better ones, of course. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Another one, seven, eight. Really? Nine? 
pretty good. Okay, well, that's a lots of steel, lots of rigs. So what can you transport? Let's give you a schedule, right? You should take bricks and things from here. So you should load... You can load a lots of stuff. That's awesome. Well, you can load these two. You can load 100% of these, like steel and bricks. And that's it. And what you can unload... You can unload all of those stuff right over here there so you should unload this and that and I think for now we're pretty good and maybe I'm not going to let the train work right away because we don't have really 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 nothing really much oh no 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 don't go there again so this storage room pick up these two resources unload them for now that's it we really don't have lots of these things for the train to get loaded, so we can actually let it go a little bit later. What I was thinking also about is to make oil production right away. Why? Because we can supply our vehicles with our own oil and uh, that's going to be cheaper. Also, we can export lots of the excess oil as well. As we see, people are mostly healthy. Uh, unemployment is decreasing. Let's see, does anybody have any kind of problem? They need a place of spirituality and they don't have work. Place of spirituality. And nobody's complaining about kindergartens, so that's cool. Really don't like, lots of people complain usually about kindergartens. And uh, you need lots of kindergartens when uh, population is exploding like this. That's the thing. And yes, it's exploding because we have 300 babies and average age of like 23. So probably population is going to explode. And yes, let's set up also some uh, around the city transportation. And I'm going to set up some more places of spirituality if they are going to work anyway. Does anybody actually go to these churches? Do they work at all? Actually, I don't see anybody in any of them. Huh. Oh, it's working. Okay, so this one is working. I suppose most of them do work then. Lots of workers are coming. There's one more bus. It's going to be okay. So let's make a university here right away. We're going to need university because we really want to get to this research. And let's make the small university, modded one, technical university, smaller because I don't want anything like too big or something for now. And let's build it near some kind of station, near some kind of tram station or some kind of bus station, so students can get there easily. And uh, how many stations do I, I... I remember... Why don't I have station here? I actually remember putting one there, right? I have one station here. So one is here. One is here. One is here. Three stations? Okay, well, never mind. Let's build a university here near this one. So let's... Um, let's, like, uh, level our land a little bit. So we can accommodate uh, university and uh, campus and stuff. So let's buy that modded university, put it over here, just right near this station. So most students will be able to get here and also I'm going to send one bus there as well, why not? So let's build it like uh, over here, right? Maybe near some other station as well too. Maybe even here, why not? Huh? How about that? Sounds like a decent idea. Because here in the city center we have malls, we have... So here it would maybe may a little bit better to build a few buildings. 
Well, here it's really good for university. Let's build a university there then. Why not? Up, not lowering terrain, like making it not average down. Hide from the center. Doesn't work really. Okay. How about this? Hmm, let's try to increase the height of terrain from here like this. What's wrong with you? So our campus is going to be over here. I think that's suitable enough really. And after that I'm going to build the uh, oil industry and the food industry will follow in and so on. Okay, these guys are pretty fast in building this terrain leveled well. Pretty good thing. Excellent. So let's buy our small technical university. Should we just connect it like right here? Maybe not. Maybe we should pass the street first. Like this a little bit, right? The, and then make university over here. So let's do that. There it goes. Oh, now we sh should like... Maybe like this, huh? How about that? Maybe even better like this. Yep, pretty much good. Okay, let's connect this with the train station. So walking is easy. There it goes, there it goes. Awesome, look at that. And let's also build a... Uh, like a home for students, like a campus stuff and so on, so education related, university halls of residence, yes, things like that, halls of residence, well, we could get a cheaper one, what's the difference, anyway, oh, actually they fit pretty nicely there, like this, that's cool, so let's just extend this road a little bit, like this, and then build our student's home. Maybe is this one better, right? <coughs> no, actually this narrow one is kind of a little bit better for me. We can even build it like this. Maybe like this. And then walking path in between. like this and then connect it like this here I think that's pretty much great so these students might need like services buying things I don't know how will that go never mind so there's a university and let's build a uh, tram line finally for this university to work and where can we build oh we do have our tram station so let's see what trams can we get we can get this fiat stuff or we can get the skoda or ziu skoda is cheapest ziu is a little faster and it can transport a little bit more people well maybe skoda Let's get this one Z, why not? Actually, let's get two of them. So one we go one direction, another one we will go another direction. So you're going to go like... Uh, you're going to go like this. Your start, let's say you're going to start uh, here at the campus. And you're going to go in this direction over there. Here. Station 3, station, we have a station 4. No, we do have just 3 stations. Okay. So, like this. There is station 1 then. Uh, how comes I don't see it? Hello? 
Station one, please. Am I like... Oh, there is a station one. Well, honestly, who's gonna wanna go from here? No need. Well, okay, just these three stations, I suppose. So, station three. Right, this is station three. Then station two. Then station four. And then you go back again to station three. And you're not going to transport workers, maybe just these most educated ones, and you can transport everybody else. So, like this. I think that's cool. Same thing here. So I think like that it's pretty good. And like this as well, that's pretty good. Alright. So some trolley buses will, will go like that. Like this, like this, like that. Oh, can do that. I can think you can start going. So he's going like 3, 2 and 4. <coughs> And you are going to start from uh, 4, 2, 3. So you can start from 4 and 1 and 2 and 3, like this. And also you're going to transport only highly educated workers and students and nobody else. So there it is, you can get to work. Why not? Good. And let's see how many people are waiting here. Maybe we should maybe workers shouldn't be waiting at all. Let's see will their numbers decrease. I'll let them wait if they want to, but they're waiting for nothing. <coughs> of course we also have many students waiting, so let's get their one bus as well too. Let's say uh satisfy their needs whatever and of course this is going to be some kind of cheap city bus nothing expensive well we can get a zeal because we already have a blue like uh, trolley why not the blue bus i think that's that's nice like aesthetically so let's get one one of these buses and one of these guys he will transport passengers well basically anywhere where there are schools he can transport passengers like from uh, <coughs> maybe from here to well he should also be visiting lots of places maybe there and here like these three stations or maybe well not that doesn't doesn't no need to go there honestly Maybe he should cover all of this area, honestly. And one more bus, maybe. So this one should cover here, and uh, then uh, here, and here, and here, and then he will go back to the bus station. And he also will transport educated workers and students. I think that's pretty good enough. No other ordinary workers. They can just wait ordinary buses and go to the mines. And the uh, other thing they can do is they can walk to something nearby and that's it for them. Okay, so these buses will transport people like this. That's what I call mobility. And let's get right away one more Zil bus. Zil is a Soviet factory that used to manufacture buses, and trams and so on. So this one goes to this one, then four. This one is four, right? Yes. No, this one is yes. So that one, four, three, and two. This will start from two, three, and four. Okay, two, three, and four. Very well. So let's get this one. You're going to start here as well. Actually, you might start from... Well, yeah. We'll start from here as well, and then go here, and then here, and then here. So I think we've got everything covered, like this. So also you're going to transport students 
free time people and highly educated workers are allowed and just ordinary workers no like this I think that's good enough so let's let let's let these guys go and do their work right so you can start going you can start going as well there he goes So I think transportation is pretty good for now and as you see employment is decreasing steadily a little bit so most of people are managing to successfully find work. Oh yes we can we can actually start with exporting something. Should we? Why are these trucks so slow to transport anything? Maybe we should get a few more of them. Huh? Steel is good, they're transporting steel successfully. This one well it's full but Okay, I think this rate of uh, steel transport is pretty good, but bricks are definitely not. Look, somebody should, more of them should come to pick up bricks. So let's buy a few more trucks for bricks. So let's buy uh, open hull, right? Well, this is the same thing, open hull, yeah. Okay, two more of these guys to transport bricks around. Is coal coming in? Yeah, they also have enough coal. Alright, so pick this thing up, bring it here. Bricks, unload bricks, go. You also take bricks from here, put them here. Load bricks, unload bricks, and go. <laughs> Maybe we can make a loading station as well. Let's see how. Let's see. Do we have a capacity? Does this factory have a capacity for it? Unfortunately, it does not, which is kind of stupid. You see, they're full with bricks. They can't produce anymore. Okay, more trucks are going to arrive to help you with bricks. How's the iron going? Iron is full. Storage is full. And where is the train that transports all the stuff? Hello? Hello? There it is. It's unloading. Okay. Okay, so these, go these guys make steel and uh, they get enough coal, I hope. More than enough. <coughs> Except that's good. More workers are coming in. Great. Here too, yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, they get loaded pretty quickly, which is really nice. So look how much steel is coming in. That's great. Now let's see what's happening in our new university. We forgot about it. <coughs> oh, people are coming in. Students, great. People are coming in by foot as well. Great. So, oh, no power. Ah, oh, We forgot about power. Sorry. Do, do, do. Where can I get you power from? And where is the wiring for this thing? Oh, there it is. Okay, we can just put a little bit of a medium voltage switch there. Perfect for switch. Oh, come on. Hey. goes and then we can build this uh, thing well here I guess 
there it goes and then bring this like here and uh, it's going to be a little tougher let's bring it here oh works well that's nice and like this great it will work just fine like that cool so everybody has power yes they do have power do you have power no students in this hostel. Mm, where can you walk? You can't walk to buy anything, that's for sure. Little bit of a problem there. Oh, well, we have enough students already, so that's kind of cool. Okay, so let's build some engineering stuff. Can you walk there? You can walk to university, great. Let's import some of the... Well, not everybody can work here, that's the problem. Maybe we should build one little custom special building for professors. Let's do that. So let's build one little house, one small house, high quality housing for teachers. What do we have in the mod? In the mod we have not one. This four-story building seems to be great option. So let's build it somewhere here. Now somewhere where they can also like buy the things they need. Can we uh. Oh okay well we can break break the church. Now we're showing a real face. <laughs> Nobody goes to this church anyway, so not a big deal, I suppose. <coughs> I just hope that workers that live here will be able to buy the need, things they need and whatnot. Let's check that. So actually, don't give me citizens on this one. <coughs> Parking lot is making a problem, really? Ugh. Probably it's going to work now. You could say it works. Let's restore the bats. Uh, did we get the citizens here? I don't remember. Let's cancel it. Oh my god. And let's build it again. a little bit tricky. Now, unfortunately, we can't really just build it like that. We have to plan it a little bit better, if you ask me. So let's try to do that. Let's try to build it... Uh, like this a little bit better maybe we'll see
pass here anyhow. No. What is reachable from here anyway? Not many things. Well, you know what? This is a bad place for a building anyway. These professors probably will they find work for somewhere else. How many people we have here? 125. some housing here <clears throat> or instead of this building actually I have an idea let's break this building unfortunately no kindergarten available really you have a plant you from kindergarten come on Alright, let's try even with the smaller houses for teachers and other staff members. Just a few houses actually will be enough. So that's really not a big deal. Modded houses. Where is this kind of house? Oh, this one. This one is pretty high level of housing quality. So let's build a few of these houses here. Let's start, let's say, from... Uh, here. Mm -hmm. Good. And then one here. And then one here. Oh, fits well. Can you fit well? Good. I think this is going to be good. And we don't have any citizens here to get, so that's nice. Let's build the walking paths. You can uh, come on. I'm not breaking them, building them. Oh my god. Can you even go there to work, huh? Okay, so nobody lives in these small houses. Let's import some workers there, right? So five experts, let's import them here. And let's import five more. Here, let's import five. And here, let's import five. And let's see, can this even guy walk to university? That's not, doesn't seem to be very near, honestly. They can. Good. So everybody work there. Everybody work here. Everybody go to work here. So that's going to be good. And this is just the common stuff. It will come from other buildings around. So this is just like rooms for teachers. Let's see, how many teachers can even work there? Not many, I presume. You know what I'm thinking now? I should have bought bigger, I should have bought definitely bigger university. Oh my. Because this university, only six professors can teach here. Oh, can we increase the productivity? How many? Oh, 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 well, 20 teachers can work there. That's good. Okay, so can you actually go and buy groceries you need? You can. Good. Can you have a culture? Yes. You cannot go to drink, but that kind of never mind. You know what? That's good. Your job is nearby. What else do you want? 
So everybody works there, everybody here works there, excellent, and everybody here is there. So 20 people, 20 highly educated people. All of them can go and work here. And not many of them do. <laughs> import a little bit more of these guys more so we have 30 highly educated people I hope more of them will start working over there and they are that's good supply where nothing has a power supply nobody works now here right that's stupid <laughs> all right so for now lots of things seems to be working just fine it's good one worker without two workers without a job. Come on, really? How can I delete this thing? Specified. Okay, so this is this house is unspecified, you are specified, and you are specified. Okay, so you guys, there is 20 of you, and you will have to work here. I don't see what's the problem with that since this building can take 20, 20 people there. And these guys, they can work anywhere they want. And I can also set something like this maybe. Uh, oh, actually, why not set up hospital as well so you can work wherever you want? So how about that? Okay, so you can choose to work in a hospital or in a uni or at a university. I think that's a pretty good choice. Okay, definitely only one teacher will be doing this engineering research. Last chance to buy. We bought ten of these, and now you cannot buy them anymore. That's what I, that, that that's, that's the thing I was telling you. You could you can buy this thing for a limited number of time, and then you cannot anymore, which is kind of cool. I have some of them. Okay, well, not of you should go like everywhere, obviously. Nine teacher can teach twenty one students. Interesting. You know what, let's get here some more universities, because why should students wait around? So what if we build like a... Oh, this is huge thing. Totally... Uh, totally not very nice to fit here. Look how huge is that? It's ridiculous. Let's make some smaller one. Party headquarters. Well, I don't know. That's a kind of college, I think, so... Let's put it over there as well. No, 
this like this is pretty nice There you go, like this. Okay, we have a decent amount of, amount of teachers. And does everybody have work from here? Here, everybody's working from here. Okay, so more teachers, please. Like, let's, let's put like 70 30. No kindergarten, no talk. Well, some room in this one. Plenty of room in this one. You can't go to this one, can you? Okay, let's try to build these guys some uh, laundry place. What about the storage? It's probably full by now. It's not full, but it's nearing full. Alright, so actually we can set our train going, huh? How about that? You can start going. Let's see how that goes. Oh, that's just great. Hmm, <laughs> look at that. This why it's not reachable. Because it connects like this. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. No, nope, it's reachable now. Yep, it can go, of course. Okay, this is an hour long video. So, guys, thank you very much for watching. I think this is it for this video. And uh, see you in the next one, I hope. Uh, Click the like button and subscribe button if you like the video, of course, and see you in the next episode. Thank you. Bye.